Good morning, welcome back to another video and today we are going to be going over a very simple gold farm that you can do on the daily. Let us begin. Okay, so today we're going to be going all the way over towards Dust Wallow Marsh and going over towards Alcaz Island just off the coast. Here you'll be wanting to just run into the top side or the biggest area and you're going to be wanting to take out some of the mobs. Coincidentally, what I will recommend for you is by just running up the stairs and just going towards the top. You will see an NPC called Dr. Weevil. This guy, once slain, and he will take a couple of hits, has a chance of dropping the big red ray gun. Which, if we go in towards Worth It and we go all the way over towards Farms and Toys, with the Big Red Ray Gun, it sells for around about 27,999 gold, or 28k, let's just say that. And at a 0.04 sell rate, which runs on the same lines as most of the other toys. However, the Big Red Ray Gun has a higher sell rate than all of those toys put together. And taking, for instance, the Crush and Thrusher controllers, these are these will sell eventually but it's a good way to actually gather up a nice bulk load of this item as if it works like the lotus Numen dice or the dwarven dice as well then you're going to want to gather up a load of these with dr weevil for instance this actually drops at a three percent drop chance which is pretty dang good and overall all you have to do is just camp this mob once you're actually in the, the area, you can just park an ult here. This is the method. Get an ult that you rarely use, shove them there, and you have a 3% chance. Whenever you log, he'll pretty much be always up, as he has a 15 minute respawn timer, give or take a few minutes. That means it works same along the same lines as Not Karosh within Frostfire Ridge within Draenor. Now, if you remember that in Frostfire Ridge within Draenor, you can get a hold of the pet, the mount called the Garn Nighthowl, which sells for a few hundred gold. However, if it's on the same respawn timer, remember that it's not at 100% drop chance like Knockrosh, but it's the same sort of method. Park an ult there, log whenever you feel like it, and take out Dr. Weevil. With a 15 minute respawn timer, you shouldn't have that much of a knock problem and it should be the farm I would recommend in which you actually do is just log as and when you have a chance not camp here for ages and just wait till he's up what I would recommend is always just have it as an as and when you have finished another gold farm just jump in do that and then see what you actually get along with that some of the mobs in the area actually drop a few different types of other materials which you can then vendor alongside that however what you're really going for is the big red ray gun which overall sells quite nicely on the auction house other than that guys that's a nice little tip bit for an, a quick little easy log farm if you want any other different types of gold making resources then please feel free to go over towards the patreon and other than that guys take it easy and i shall see you in the next video which will be soon mm -hmm.